What's going on everybody? This is Javi Vasquez. Although it is one of the best limb-based submissions available, the Kimura can be challenging to finish. I can break up finishing a Kimura into two different problems, the grip and limiting movement to prevent the opponent from escaping or rolling out. I feel it can be difficult to finish a traditionally gripped Kimura. In this video, I will focus on the Super Kimura grip, which limits the opponent from being able to move. The Super Kimura grip helps to solve these issues. It gives incredible control by stretching the opponent's arm into a spirally locked position while adjusting the grip closer towards the opponent's hand, maximizing leverage prior to and during the application of breaking pressure. Here is just one of many examples of how to utilize the Super Kimura, this time from inside the opponent's guard. I hope you enjoyed this content and as always, thank you for watching. So, when I'm on top, what, what do I want to do? Split. Split. Right. Always. Pretty much every single damn time I'm going to split his guard. So when I get to here, what I want to do is be on the inside. Do I work a little bit? Just keep doing this. I'm trying to get to his hand and pin his hand to his hip. So I want to get my grip early. So I'm here, I'm, I'm working right, here. what would you do? Oh, I'm pinning his hand and I'm pinning it to his hip. Once I pin the hand to the hip, I do this, boom. Now what do you do? All my weight is on that hand. Even if you do that, go, do whatever you want. Go. He can do whatever he wants. All the weight's on that hand, I get over it, it's gone. So when I get to here, I'm working the pass, poof, I'm getting to his hand. Once I get my grip, I take it away from his body. Now, I'm already pinning his arm over here, so he's gonna try and push, whatever. If he does, I fall forward. Elevate the arm wrap. One, two, go. So I'm getting the arm out in outer space. The same way I got the arm on outer space on the Kimura, on the other one, from side mount. So as I'm splitting them here, I'm trying to get to here. See how I did that? I go here and then I change it. Get my grip. Once I'm here, a lot, by pinning it to his hip, they don't, they don't kind of register yet. <laughs> it doesn't register. But it allows me a second to hold on to the arm. Because if I just grab it, and hold it, you feel it, you're gonna to wanna to do what? Get it away. So I'm playing possum for half a second. I grab it and I do that. What do you feel? Do you feel like, or do you wanna pull it away? Eh, I mean, kind of, but not really. <laughs> because it's touching you so you feel safe. So the second, what I do is I throw this out and now, no matter what he does, do something, anything. I go forward. Doesn't matter. He can half guard me. He can do whatever he wants. As he's working on that, I am so over the arm. All my weight's on top of the arm. Because of the throttle, it limits his motion. Go, where, where are you going to go? Make sense? Because his arm is isolated and all my weight's on top of it. So I'm going to control his ankles and I'm going to split his legs. Once I split his legs, I sit on top of the shin. High split. It's called a high split. From here, my hands want to be on the inside. As he starts to push me away, even if he doesn't, I get to his hand. No matter what, I get to his hand, this is his hand. Now I pin it to his hip. As I pin it to his hip, as I start to lean my weight this way, what do you want to do? Shrimp your hip? Yeah, right. Boom. I'm holding him in place here. Whatever your next move is going to be, what is it? <laughs> Whatever your next move is going to be, what is it? Boom, boom, boom. Control, 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 control. The entire time you've got control. Questions? Anybody need to see it again? So hand, glue to the hip. From the hip, you go to the ground. From the ground, you lay on top of it, and then you, if you can lay on top of it and shoot under it at the same time, even better, right? Sometimes you can skip that step. So I'm here, I'm here, I start to pass this way. See what I do? I'll start to pass 
So I start using his own hand to push. Once I do that, look at I've already created the angle. And this, there's all kinds of space there. Go on. Question. Go. Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching my video. Please click like and subscribe to my channel for more great strike based Jiu Jitsu content. If you have any questions about the techniques that I'm demonstrating, please leave a comment in the comment section below. Thank you so much.